Hey everybody, it's the Handbag Hauler here coming to you today with an unboxing. But if you will, please leave your, um, I was going to say name and number. Mm -hmm. Let me try that again. Hey everybody, it's the Handbag Hauler here coming to you with a video today. But if you will, hit that like and subscribe button and the bell button for my notifications when I do another video. So I'm gonna do a quick unboxing here. As you can see, I did open the box because I was curious, but I said I have to have you guys along with me as I really unravel what's in this box. So let's get into it. So I caught these two bags during the sale. And this is just getting utterly ridiculous. However, I couldn't resist these two. So, the first one is the 1975 tote in black. I had to get the tote after I got the gouchette. I was in love with this whole vibe to this bag. Um, just the colors, the material, and everything. It's just, I love this. So let me go ahead and open this, because I might carry this tomorrow. I don't know. So, this is my second in this pattern that I have. I'm adding to my collection. And I am loving this already. I'm loving the sides. It's kind of reminding me of my coach. Um, uh, is it the gal? I think it's the gallery coat. But this is this is just. I love this. I am so glad I have decided to add this to my collection. So there's the bottom with the four feet. So pretty. Now I have been going through Dillard's and Belk. You know, just kind of browsing, and they had a couple of bags with this pattern on it. And you know, I, I was checking it out, and I was like, you know, this is really cute. I, I'm really digging this this style of duty here. And like I said, because 1975, that's my year. Um, it it really, I really said I had to add this. So let's put this in this bag. So we got the braided zipper pull there. And I like how the zipper is closed. It's closed off here. So you're not having that space. Um, this bag, yeah. So like this is this is what I'm carrying now. This monogram tote in the um, medium and see how it has the space right there. You don't have to worry about, oh, I'm gonna hit in a face with my straps. You don't have to worry about if this is something that bothers you, your zipper pull or your zipper being stuck out like that. So you don't have, that's not something you have to worry about with this type of closure, with this bag. So let's open her up. Take the, all the fun stuff out. And the red, got the red lining with the normal dummy set up here. You have your key keeper, as you can see. You got a two slip pockets here. And your zipper pocket here at the top, and then at the top of the zipper, then you have your um, slip pocket there. Let me get this out of here now so I can remind myself to do that. So if I have any problems like my other bag, I have to take send back, and I'll keep you guys posted on that one. Um, you'll be able to send that back. So always, always, always register your doing bags. Now the zipper, as you can see, is already tucked down in there and you cannot get it out. So that's that's a plus for me. Um, 
Let me take this off my hair too. This is really cute. Like I said, it goes with pretty much everything. If you got yellow, if you got pink, uh, purple, green, two different blues. You got red in there. You got a kind of brownish color. It looks like brown, tan. Um, but you got pretty much a lot. You got orange in there. Like all of the colors of the rainbow is in here. <laughs> So this is a nice addition. I'm excited about this one. Now what I'm really excited about, this one I was watching it and I wasn't too sure about it at first, but it's, it's a unique silhouette and I think that's what really attracted me to this bag. So this is the Florentine Brindley in the color navy. So this bag, I really don't like this. And this is gonna go with my fall layout in my closet. This is nice. So I I love it already. I love it already. And I always love the smell of Florentine. This is just awesome. So this is more of a, a crook of your arm back here. As hopefully you can see. So it's, you, you, it's not really passing the elbow test. You gotta kinda get your arm out <laughs> like that when you carry this bag. Um, it's a more of a north-south silhouette. And one of the other things that attracted me to this bag is because it has the red outline of the zipper that I really like that detail. And you have a magnetic closure. And I didn't get a dust bag with that one, but that's okay. This one came with a dust bag. I'm seeing not, not all of them are coming with dust bags and that doesn't mean that it's a fake Dooney because I ordered it from Dooney. I love Dooney. So it is a real Dooney. It just didn't come with a dust bag. No big deal to me. Um, so it has a snap closure. It's pretty, pretty good snap because it keeps on closing on me. So that's fine. I like that. This is the top of it. And it does have a strap to it so you can make this a uh, crossbody or you can even shorten the strap to make it a shoulder bag. So let me do that so you guys can see. This is a really, really long strap. One of the other things I just noticed here is the zipper or the um, key keeper has a gun metal to it, but the hardware is actually um, brushed gold. As you can see, brushed gold. And your straps attach right there underneath the handle. And this side of that would be nice if we could fit. I really still like the zip zip, and I just really have a love hate relationship with that bag because of the strap, but um. I, I still like that, that silhouette. I just won't get it because of that strap. And that is a selling point for me. It's, yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, here we go. So this is really a long strap, you guys. Like, <laughs> put this on. This is all, this is past, past, way past my waist. <laughs> 
so I would definitely have to, uh, because I'm shorter, I would definitely have to uh, go ahead and adjust this. But I wanna see something here. So if I take this, this middle part off, I wanna see how long or how it is as a shoulder bag. I'll show you guys, cause I might just leave it as a shoulder bag, not necessarily a crossbody right now. So a shoulder bag, it would come like this. And that's more my style of bag. Just throw it on my shoulder, kind of keep that under, tucked under my arm like that. So I may just keep it like that as a the shoulder bag. And that's what it would look like with just the shoulder, using it as a shoulder bag. Um, and then, like I said, this this strap is pretty long, so I can use this as a belt. <laughs> a belt. <laughs> no, okay. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah. So this that was my two purchases from this last um, sale for Labor Day uh, from Juni, and. Um, I'm just like really excited about it. I appreciate it. Um, Peter, what all your great sales that have been going on lately. So I am gonna tuck this, oh, let me get the registration card out too. <laughs> there we go, put that in there. I don't know which one I'm gonna move into yet. So um, I'll just sit them here for a while until I decide. But yeah, so those are the two that I picked up from the Labor Day sale. These two. So yeah, that that is that. So I just want to come and unbox these two great bags with you guys. And um, I, you know, I'm sure I'll be doing a morning rush to show what fits and what I'm gonna carry in the bag. So. Thank you guys for joining me. And remember, if you're new to my channel, please hit that like and subscribe button um, and the bell button for my notifications. And if you are returning, thank you guys for returning. And I will see you all on my next video. Take care, everybody.